Hi guys, it's Laura from Mad Mimi's Crochet and Farming. Today is Tuesday, which is Bod Had a Palooza. Um, not moving much because still can't move this arm. Um, I've been to the ER. The ER cannot do anything right now. Um, so uh, we will have to wait and see what happens. But uh, prayers, continuing prayers would be great. Um, so, today is Bod Had a Palooza, and we just got finished making, uh, which one? Um, hat number 42, which was the easy to crochet beanie hat Candy Visions, and it was a tutorial number 530. Two. Excuse me. Um, no, I have not been sleeping well at all because I have been in extreme pain. But that is beside the point. So I might yawn a couple of times. Um, so this one was a fairly, um, not fairly easy. It was a, um, easy to understand tutorial. The pattern was easy. Um... The only problem I had with it is that I was playing yarn chicken and I lost. The primary reason why I lost is because I could not find another donut. I know I have like 15, 20, maybe 29 donuts of the exact same thing. Only because um, I bought it while I was um, sleep shopping. When I used to take Ambien, I would sleep shop. I'm no longer taking that, so I'm no longer sleep shopping. But because I only have use of one arm, it is hard for me to move um, things around up there. And I've looked in my um, yarn detail, could not find it. So it means that it was somewhere down here. Oh, well. So, I did lose at Yarn Chicken. I did complete the hat. The hat will just be for a smaller person. Oops. Okay. The yarn I used, and um, this is, uh, you can get this at many different um, places. And it's called different things like rock star, um, rock and roll. This is the one that I have. It is Gazal Rock and Roll, right here. That's the color. It's a blue with silver inside. Um, it is. If I remember correctly, um, it's 21% acrylic, 70% polyamide, and 9% merino. Um, it's 50 grams, 1.76 ounces, 115 meters, excuse me, or 125 yards. I, uh, my hat is much shorter um, than otherwise I would wear it, but since um, it's too short for me, it, it doesn't even cover my ears. This is what I had left from the 125 yards. This right here. Um, and um, this is what the hat looks like. You can see that it's definitely shorter. I did get all of the rounds I was supposed to get in. Um, this was a very lightweight four-weight yarn. It's more like a three, I'm guessing. Um, and uh, it could have... It could have stood to have 
another three rounds of the bobbles, double crochet, double crochet, and then the single crochet around. Um, then it probably would have fit me. But I don't know where the other yarn is. It's somewhere in there. And the boys were gone. Um, I can't remember what they were doing. So, yeah, the boys were gone. And um, I couldn't look for it by myself. So, uh, that is what it looks like. Let me put it where you can at least see it. So, yes, there it is. And I'll bring it up close again there's the all of the ends are sewn in there are only two of them but you can see it does have a halo on it and it was sticking while i was pulling it and i um used the outside one Okay, so, um, Siri has picked, I did not see if, um, I didn't see anybody picking any numbers if you stuck it in with your, um, with your, the picture of your hats, then I will get it this time, and, um, as I open it, I will, uh, put them in order on my page, uh, so we can um, see what's next. So yes, if any of you are interested in picking a hat, um, just pick a number, a random number between one and 132. So um, Siri picked number 90 today, nine zero. And Jan, you're gonna kill me again. I, I'm just gonna leave it at that. It's either bobbles or something else in it again. Uh, but you get to use two different yarns this time. I mean, you don't have to. Um, but um, but I did want your opinion on... Um, so we are using... Um, it does call for two different yarns. Um and it's a slouchy hat, so it, so we will be using a little mi little bit uh, more yarn than we normally would. Um, so this is going to be my contrast color. Um, it is Fantasy from Hobie. Color number six. It's 100% uh, acrylic, uh, 3.5 ounces, 164 yards. And it's a bulky number five. And um, so that's my contrast color. So I was looking at these two together, but I'm thinking that they're awfully close. Or, these two, the black and the purple, pinky, red, yellow, gray. So, which one do you guys like better? The black and the multi, or like the burgundy kind of, kind of ish color and the multi? Let me know what you guys think. So, um, but yes. <laughs> Slouchy hat. Um, tutorial number 763 um, is this coming week's hat. My number 90. Tutorial number 763. So, um... Yeah, that's it. I'm, uh, let me know what you guys think. Should I do the black or the burgundy with my multicolor? Alrighty, so I'm out of here. And I'm gonna, um, sit on the couch and try to do a little bit of crochet. 
Um, it's not very easy, but um, I still have to get things done. So um, I'm just holding it way down here and uh, doing it that way. So thank you guys for watching. You guys have a great day. Don't forget to watch um, afterwards so you can see all of the hats that everybody has done this week. Also, you can find me on Ravelry. I will put the link below and Pinterest um, and I will put the link below. I have a lot of crochet. I have a lot of homesteading stuff. I have a little of um, some farming stuff. Um, lots of homeschool. Lots of geocaching. I have a lot of variety of everything um, on my Pinterest. So um, look for me on Pinterest, link below. Look for me on Ravelry, link below. Don't forget to watch the showcase of hats at the end of this video. And I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.